Yo, what's up? Welcome back to what King's Gym. What kind of so- sound is this? <laughs> it was my coughing. Okay. Hope you don't mind my mysterious sound. So coughing. Mm-hmm. All right. So Jesse, I have a question for you. Okay, what kind of question? Because this morning when you went to uh, work mm-hmm. in your sifa. Yes. I was watching YouTube videos of um, Boeing. You know what Boeing is? The podcast oh, stuff. Podcast from uh, Boeing. From Boeing. Yeah. yeah. And uh, he was talking to uh, another famous YouTuber. Uh, and then, but the whole uh, thing that makes me curious okay. is that they, it's like, Bowen was talking about, uh, well, like, well, like he's been really hardworking, and then uh, to self improve in the field of like stand up comedy, mm-hmm. right? And then like every time when you uh want to have a really excellent show, you gonna look into how, uh, what things that you are gonna implement into your uh speech. Mm-hmm. So you're gonna like maybe you have this set up and then if you want to have like a punchline and how do you, where do you put the punchline to make the whole thing sounds more funnier. Yeah. And but but you don't want to be only funnier, but you also don't want to be offensive to the audience. Because mm-hmm. when when you try too hard, maybe the joke was funny, but it also can seems to be really hurtful. Like people can mm-hmm. really take it serious and thought that you were just like mm-hmm. you. It's not an like an appropriate jokes to make or something. Mm-hmm. So he usually had to do a lot of homeworks and how to manage all the jokes in the, in the, in stand up comedy. Yep. But the thing is like, one was trying to say like, it doesn't matter how much effort that he's putting into uh, modifying all the, uh, the the things that he want to uh, say to in his stand up comedy like all all those uh, people on the internet they, w- the only thing that they remember is one time when he had like the really inappropriate joke do you know uh, some like Zhen Nan Rong and there's one time that like, he made the um, inappropriate joke about someone who is like fighting for the independence of Taiwan or whatever and then I like, pissed a lot of people off so a lot of like People on the internet, they just seems like they really upset about it, and I, it doesn't matter how much effort that uh, Bowen trying to fix the jokes or make everything seems to be like it's not a big deal, or whatever. And then like people still constantly uh, attack him by saying, that, "Oh, you're just like someone who has been laughing at someone who's in who has done like a really great uh, job or has done a lot of like contribution to Taiwan. You just like you are just such a like you know." A bastard or whatever. So it means no matter how much effort you have put into your field, then uh, people will still mention the previous mistake you have made. Yeah, yeah. Which is making Boen really devastated and really like disappointed. No matter how much effort that he's trying to fix his own jokes in his standing uh, stand up comedy, but people doesn't seem to be like. To value, uh, his effort and just like all all the people cares are all about like this one mistake that he made maybe ten years ago or something whatever, mm-hmm. and then like but he was actually interviewing with somebody and he tell the story about himself, and then the person who got this kind of story, just tell tell Bowen that. Why do you take it so serious? I mean, that's the reality. That's how the environment is. Like people are meant to laugh at you or, or like judge you, with whatever mistake you have made in the past. So why do you have to make it so serious? And like you have to like keep thinking that these things hurt you. You should you should actually turn this into a joke and make it even more funnier because you are inside of this environment. You shouldn't. Be trapped inside this kind of mindset or whatever, and then like after this, because Bowen didn't seems to get the reaction that he deserved, so like I was thinking, like maybe 
Because for me, I think I will stand at the position. Position. <laughs> Sorry about it. I will stay in the position. Uh, the same thing as the the guy the born is interviewed to.、Uh-huh. So I think like, like, no matter how much effort you do, yes, people are just gonna laugh at you with the stupid mistake that you have been made in the past. No matter how long it was, but you shouldn't be. They shouldn't like be. Like really trapped it by yourself of the how people treat you this way. This is the reality. You should just move on, and then you sh- you shouldn't like you 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 shouldn't hope that people will eventually see how much effort you have made, and then like suddenly forget about all those mistakes that you have done in the past. That that's kind of like my stand. But but the thing is, I take a look at the comment in the video. All the like, from as long as from from what I've seen, like eighty five percent of the people are not thinking in this way. Eighty five percent of people are, are are like judging the the、uh, the the person who is judging Bowen. A lot of people are saying like, oh, Bowen was trying to open like his mind and try to reveal how he feels, but like those. Those people doesn't seems to get the point, and then just like constantly criticizing. Oh, boy, you shouldn't, you shouldn't like. That's what the reality is. You should just move on, or whatever. A lot of people just like criticizing this kind of thing. Well, so, is, it doesn't make sense to me. But is there any similar thing happen to the that the the other guy? I think. I think the reason why Bowen had the interview with him is because. He used, he used the same kind of、uh, jokes that Bowen made in the past, in his video. To laugh about it or and, whatever, and make、happened? a joke about it,、yeah. and maybe Bowen was feeling a little bit uncomfortable about it, so he invited to have a talk or whatever. That's what just what my guess. I don't know, but like, my, <laughs> my, uh, my point is like, how how is it like? Why is it so many people that judging those、uh, guy who are criticizing Bowen? I, mean, I just don't get it.、Mm, I think most of people couldn't get it. Like someone is really aggressive to you. Yes. I mean. Can be like physically or or mentally, right?、Mm-hmm. Attack you, but um um. But if you 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 have to stand at Bourne's position and then to um show your empathy or yeah, yeah, yeah. like like you understand his yeah, feeling, but、right? like do you where do you stand? I I mean like where do you. If you if you see all 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 the pictures and all the things that you know what I just described to you,、mm-hmm. in which position would you stand in this point? Like, would you be more leaning toward、uh, Bowen's side, or or you would stand on like? Ah,、uh, I would say my my answer would be more to Bowen's side,、really? but I can understand. Like the the opinion from the other guy is there a guy? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah from the other. Yeah, but、guy. like, I mean, why why would you stand leaning toward Bowen's side? I mean, I just I'm really curious. I mean, if you don't care about like how those people from internet, uh, they judge or they 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 like what's their comments from your video or from your interview from your show, then how can you improve yourself or how can you gain your viewers? Your audience, right?、Mm-hmm. So,、um, you gotta listen to them. Then you know how to adjust your like the content of your videos. That's how you increase your like viewers' audience、mm-hmm. and how to improve your business and more money, right? But, If you care nothing,、mm-hmm. care about nothing from their opinions, then I don't know how how could you make your business success. Successful, success, successful. But don't you feel like people have the right to judge you? I mean, that's their freedom. That's their freedom, true. But、yeah. like, you shouldn't get 
like really like if if you if you uh uh like took it really personally you know that that's your own business like if yes. people criticize you and then you just like feeling so down and you shouldn't judge those people making you down because that's the reality so i think the um, like the guy is trying to tell bowen um like from from bowen's position because you choose to le- do this job mm-hmm. then that's the thing you have to face yes right so um so you shouldn't hope that that what you have told people this story would change their behavior to treat you nicely yeah instead you have to you know like adjust your mindset a Mm -hmm. little bit and to find a way to make yourself feel better even (laughs) those people are judging you in a really really bad way yeah but even though you still choose to support born um i mean because um I know what the other guy say is correct, but I feel like I'm not the person who is able to do this. Okay. To even I know, yeah, that makes sense, but I don't. I don't have confidence that I can do it. So for me, I would say if the same thing happened to me, <laughs> I yes. guess I would have the same reaction as born. I would try to you know think about if there is anything I I I have done it wrong. But and I will try to change a little bit yeah. to to you know, prevent me myself to make more mistakes in the future. But um, no matter how much effort I put, mm-hmm. and I still get a lot of like a negative feedbacks. True. Then I yeah, will so, feel like I have done so much yeah, effort, and you're still judging me. True, I don't yeah. get it. So that's, that's what that's what Bo is saying. Bo yeah. says like. After he's been trying thousand different ways, mm-hmm. it doesn't matter which way he chooses. Mm-hmm. Every way leads to the death. Every every road leads to the same result that people were just gonna. But I think I w- I was still thinking that the other way is like right now. Oh no, I mean from before I I met a like inappropriate joke or something, and yes. then I get maybe thousands. Uh, judgment from different people, mm-hmm. but I would keep like make progress in how I prepare my shows, mm-hmm. and then I will see if those judgment get less and less. Mm-hmm. Right, I I believe that um, if you really do like put effort in it, then mm-hmm. you will see something. You will mm-hmm. have some see some change. Yes. It. Yeah, but it's not going to be like. From like hundred percent, like all the negative comments to like zero, but at least you can see from hundred to ninety and then to fifty or something. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it shouldn't expect it gets zero. Like all comments, they are all good. That's impossible. Mm-hmm. But you gotta maybe set up a standard to say, ah, uh, if it decreases, then that's the thing. Yeah. So like. But like, as what Bowen says, like, no matter how much um way that he was trying, like every every way that doesn't seems to lead to the successful way, that makes me feel like, does doesn't it seems to be the reality of our our life, right? Everyone like doesn't matter what you the job you do, what the thing you do, you know, what, what thoughtful you are. How considerate you are! Everyone is the final destination is death. You mean real death? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. So like, that is the reality. So we we shouldn't feel. So your attitude should be like, what the? Yeah, like, like I don't we, care. We shouldn't feel sad <laughs> about eventually we're gonna die. Right. So it's like it's like the same attitude as like, oh, no matter how much I do. And、uh, people is gonna judge me, so I shouldn't Wait, do any I, effort. Wait, but I I think if you thinking that way, like no matter how much effort you you have done, then eventually it's all lead to death. Yeah, that's what you say, right? Yeah. So if you like, 
if it all leads to death, then why do you need to put effort in it? Then you shouldn't care about like how much effort you you put or like how people judge you or whatever because. But how much it effort work. doesn't relate it? It's not the same thing as how many judgment from others. Like uh, like how how much effort you put? That's uh, like a self fulfill <laughs> for, for fulfillment. Film? Yes. Yeah, right. So it's different thing. Really, you you don't think that could be the same kind of uh, concept? Ah,、uh, I feel it's different. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. One is how you face yourself, and then the other one is how you face others. So one is like inside and outside.、Mm-hmm. Yeah. And I, I wanna mention another thing is like I kind of understand uh at Bowen's position, right? And I also think that what uh Bowen was trying to do is like just to inform all his audience about what actually hurt him. So like those audience could. Have some sort of a notice or like a realization of like oh this kind of behavior is actually hurting Bowen, so we should avoid doing this more to make the world a better place. If those people are like really you know rational,、um, so I think like、mm-hmm. you, but if you, they are you can choose you can choose to say nothing as a like as as a comedian. Right, you can choose to like just say whatever. I don't care. But you can also choose to just reveal your true self, like telling people, "Oh, this one actually hurts me," and to hope for a really um uh like I I don't know like hope for the、uh, the best, and then that people will treat me nicely after I reveal my true self. I mean, that's I think that's what Bowen's strategy in 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 this play. But if people they are rational, is that a word? Yeah. Um, they won't leave the aggressive comment. I mean, not、right? all the people who are leaving aggressive comments are rational, but some of them, yes. But that's、yeah. kind of like a reduce the amount of the audience who、but、will have. Maybe just a little, just a little bit. Yeah, but it's still a little. But、that's、for for the most of、right? them, for most of them. They will leave more like more like worse comments. They will oh, say, yeah, "Oh, he's a bit drunk." Yeah, 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 true. Yeah, but so, I think that's uh that's also one of the effort that Bowen was trying to fix the whole issues. So、yeah. um that's the the thing that I want. So to if you, you cannot change others, you should change yourself. I mean that sounds really like really uh you know um how do you say it like hmm. Unfortunately, but unfortunately, yeah, right. <laughs> Because you cannot change your environment. That's kind of unfortunate, right? Because the only thing you can do is like changing yourself, right? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So I mean, what else can we do, right? So we still have to, you know, move on and、uh, live our everyday life. So that's the thing I want to talk to you. Okay. Yeah, that's it. The video for today. How was your、uh, first day of your、um, easy? No, actually, second. The video is too long. Oh, sorry about it.、All、See、right. you guys next time. next time. See you back.